Dr. Arun, you know, when religious nationalism emerged as the dominant idea propagated by the BJP, uh, why wasn't the Congress able to offer a compelling alternate idea that resonated with the voters? Well, frankly, I, I, I don't understand it because we are the original party of nationalism. It's the Congress mm. that was the nationalist movement incarnate that actually won India its independence. Mm. Uh, when I wrote my book, An Era of Darkness, I was talking about the entire sort of ideological rationale for the Indian National Congress as a nationalist party. Um, somehow that has lost its hold on the imaginations of the people in the face of the kind of very jingoistic, chest-thumping, uh, even militaristic sort of messaging that has come out of the ruling party. And, um, you know, uh, in a democracy, voters will get what they want. And I, I have to say, we have to respect their wishes. Uh, I would have wanted us to offer a more inclusive nationalism as an alternative to this Hindu nationalism. Mm. I would have wanted to speak about nationalism transcending religious considerations or linguistic or regional or caste considerations for that matter. Sure. I would have liked to have talked about our diversity mm. as part of the strength of our nationhood. And I did all this in my constituency in Kerala. Mm. And in Kerala, that message was well received. Would it have been well received in the north? I don't know because perhaps it wasn't tried.